What's up, guys? Welcome back to the Mark Show. It's time for another episode of our 2020 Fantasy Football Pick'em. This is now week five. If you're new to this, here's how it goes. I show you guys how I did last week. Then once we go through that, I should show you my lineup that I'm going to do for the current week. And then after that, I kind of take a little sneak peek into the following, the next coming week's Thursday night game. If I have anybody playing, uh, I will most likely either add them or let you know if I'm going to start them or not play them as such. So pretty simple. Now let's get into it. So we are now in week five. So what we're going to do is take a look back at the week four, how I did. And so right now, as you see, I am one and three. So that pretty much means that I lost my game against Clipmaster. And here's the thing, guys, you got to look at. I would go against him when Tom Brady and Cooper, uh, Cooper kills it. They both pretty much doubled their scores. I had no chance. I literally had no chance. And look how he did. Ridley, zero. Chubb left the game. Robinson, 14 points. 17, 8.5. The, the kicker, 18 points for the kicker. I had zero shot of winning this game. Zero shot. When a kicker has 18 points, what can you do? Literally, Brady and Cooper killed it pretty much um, 76 points. At 18 of that, that's 90 plus points right there. Come on, like, I had no shot. Like, none. So, it is what it is. It's got to move on to next to next week. So, now let's go ahead and take a look at the current week, week five. I am going against CD's Nuts. Uh, as you guys can tell, uh, we got some crazy names for our squads, as you can see. So... That's what I'm going to get to see these nuts. Uh, so let's go ahead and pull up my squad. And let's go ahead and get this roster going. So as you guys see here, I have Scotty Miller playing for uh, uh, playing this week for Thursday night game this past Thursday. I picked him up because I dropped uh, another I dropped. No, actually, uh did I jump the receiver? I don't remember. I think I dropped somebody and I had to pick somebody up. Well, Scotty Miller's hurt. If you guys watched the game this past week, he had zero looks. He had, I think, a, a small little injury, but it, it's just, look, zero points. I could have put nobody there. It'll still have the same amount of points. So it is what it is. Now, let's go ahead and... See if we can maybe catch up or some points with other players on our team. So for quarterback, Burrow's playing Baltimore. Drew Brees playing the Chargers. So let's go ahead and change that. Put Drew Brees in. All right. So we now have uh, Diggs. See, he's not going nowhere, as you can tell on my bench. Matt Jones is on the bye, so Detroit's on the bias week. This is, I think, this is the week where a lot of t teams are getting their buys. Uh, so Detroit's on the bye. Now that was my receivers, but I want to look at something real fast. Thomas, he's questionable, but what's going on with him right now? Uh, okay, so. As of Friday, he was practicing, but very limited. Uh, he was limited back-to-back -back practices, making him was a questionable final injury in week five. We'll get the final press report on Saturday with the games playing on Monday Night Football this week. Let me see. Thomas will be, if he's able to go through his high ankle sprain. So, you know something? Uh... I'm scared to put him in. He may have to be a last minute sub here. So, you know something? I have to pretty much wait till Sunday morning to know 
if he's going to play. Now, if he is going to play, hope, I hope I could be a catch in time because I will put him in for the flex if he does play. If he doesn't, like I said, we won't know Sunday. Higgins will stay in. So pretty much that's, I don't know, for that right there. I got to wait till Sunday morning to get the final answer. Now, for running backs, uh, you guys got Taylor and Hunt. They're going to stay in, of course. Kelsey is going to stay in for as the tight end. That's Miller, of course, ain't going nowhere. Now, for my defense, uh, got Baltimore and Tennessee. I am rolling with Baltimore. I will stay with them. So, with that being said, all right, so now I'm at 119. Now, let's actually go back here. So, if I put in, I just want to see what the point's looking like. Oh. I wonder if I can put him in. Okay, so he's in, so. Did it save? Huh. So pretty much it's extra nine points to that, so that'd be 128. But we'll know more on Sunday. So as of right now, Higgins is in. So that's where I'm looking at. So right now, season that's at 141 projected. I'm at 119. And uh, damn, dude, look at this. I'm going against now Wilson and Hopkins this week. Wilson's killing it. Hopkins looking good. DK Metcalf, Elliot, oh man, come on. Yeah. So I need a miracle for this week, as you guys can see. I need a miracle. Because right now, like I said, Wilson's killing it, Hobson's killing it, Elliot uh, here and there. But, oh boy. Oh man. So I got to do that again. So hoping for a miracle this week, guys, that I could pull it off. That someone don't play well or just, um, God forbid, an injury, but I prefer someone not playing well in an injury. So, yeah, this is what I'm rolling with. So, with that being said, let's go ahead and look at uh, week six, Thursday night game, if they has one. So, yes. Oh, wow. Buffalo and Kansas City. Oh, wow. So, you guys already know I – Stefan Diggs will be playing. So that uh so for this coming up Thursday night game. So he will be in. But other than that, that's it, guys. Pretty simple enough. Um good luck to everybody out there. Hope you guys win um your games tomorrow. I'll put you in a position to win and hopefully still put you in a position to get closer to making the playoffs. Right now, as you guys see, I'm on the outside looking in. So I need to get a win. I, I have to get a win. I got to be two and three. If I go down one and four, that's not looking good. N not looking good at all. So I have to get a win some kind of way. But you know something? It's possible. You know, I could definitely sneak in as a 60. So we'll see. Well, guys, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. You see on the screen right now. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video with people. And like I said, good luck to all you guys out there for this week's fantasy football uh, pickles on your own leagues. Like I said, especially if it's a money league, you know, you got just, you want to take somebody's money. But the only way you can do that by making the playoffs and keep winning games. And right now for me, I'm not looking so hot. But uh, I, I got to play catch up pretty much. I, I got to get a, a winning streak going here. I got to get hot as soon as possible. Well, guys, that's it for today's video, and we'll see you next week. In the words of my baby Zoe, we'll see you next time. Peace.